Alright, this is my six month review of the Blitzart Tornado GT Generation 2 dual motor skateboard. I've had mine for about six months now. Still in pretty good shape. Wheels still look pretty good, as you can see. I've probably uh, put about somewhere between 75 to 100 miles on it. Uh, probably about 50 battery charges. Uh, last, I probably ran it completely out of battery three or four times. Last time being about a week ago. Unlike some other skateboards that I've seen that go real slow. But they'll keep on going. This one will still go like 10 miles per hour. And it, then it'll just shut down like that. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Uh, from uh, completely being dead, it took me like 2 hours and 15 minutes to recharge it a week ago. I'm 191 pounds. And top speed for me on, on the board so far has been 16 miles per hour on a flat surface. I don't really, I'm in Texas, I don't really have a lot of hills around here. The hills I have gone, it's got plenty of torque for me, as you'll see later in the video on a speed test from 0 to 16 gets there pretty quick. And I found the brakes to be really good. I really like to ride it on the seawall in Galveston. I have people uh, walk out in front of me, and uh, I'll have to slam on the brakes real quick, and it, it stops me pretty good. That's helped me a couple times avoid some dangerous situations. Uh, let me see what else. Uh, overall, uh, oh, I really like the board. One thing uh, about the remote, I did have to replace one remote. Uh, it still worked, but it wouldn't charge anymore. Uh, so far, I've had no connection issues whatsoever. Uh, losing connection between the remote and the skateboard. I have, uh, at the end of its battery life, if you're hitting uh, some good bumps in the road, There'll be a little lag time before, uh, I mean, just barely any lag, but th it is there when you hit a bump. And this is more towards the end of the, after you've been riding it a while. Uh, so far for the range of me, like I said, I'm 191 pounds. Uh, six and a half miles is uh, the most I can achieve, but that's going like 85 to 90% full throttle the whole time. I found uh, Blitzart customer service to be really good. When I first bought this board, I actually bought another board on eBay through their eBay uh, store uh, that I paid $379 for. It was a first generation dual motor, and when I got it in the mail, it was uh, the tire, one of the tires was already cracked. Contacted them, and they said no problem, sent me a return label to send it back. I sent it back, and then they upgraded me to their new Generation 2 for no charge. It's probably one of the first ones to get it. So like I say, I've had it for six months. The only problem I've had is uh, the one remote that came out. It was only like $15 or $16 to replace the remote. Uh, and I've contacted them, the customer service, two or three times about things that I thought were wrong but weren't wrong, just my mistake, and they've always been excellent in getting right back to me. You can call them on the phone. Uh, I think they're based in California. I'm sure they're from China, but uh, you can call them in California and uh, talk to them, and they'll help you out. So that's my review. Uh, stay tuned for some more video of uh, the data.